Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to talk about how to use Chat GPT to prepare for your help desk and desktop support interview. Myself, Mohammad Zubair, and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro really fast. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Well, as we know that ChatGPT has taken the internet by storm and users are very surprised by using it because it is helping people in almost every way that is possible. So we'll see that if we can prepare our interview for a help desk and desktop support role. First of all, let's say I do not have any idea that what are the job responsibilities that are expected from the help desk or desktop support person. So for that purpose, I can use ChatGPT to ask it. So I'll write here, what are the job responsibilities for the help desk and desktop support person? Let's hit enter. So for the start, ChatGPT is telling us that what are the responsibilities that are expected from the help desk or a desktop support person. So here we have a detailed information about that and in case if you are not satisfied over this information you can ask for another response for example if i write here please explain it further but in easier way and let's see what do we get this time so what it will do now it will give me the same information or there might be some changes but it will make sure that i get the information in more simpler way and the information that i can understand easily so let's say we are done with understanding the responsibilities. Now what we want, we want to know that what should we prepare. So let's say I'll ask my chat GPT, what kind of certifications should I do for this job? And let's ask our chat GPT about it. I'll hit enter. Now what chat GPT will do, it will give me some certifications like A plus certification, CompTIA network plus certification and something like this. So you can see here, here it says CompTIA, then we have Network Plus. At the top, we have A Plus. Then we have Microsoft certification and it will give you some more. So basically it is telling us that we should consider any one of these certification to get the job for help desk or desktop support guy. Other than that, you can ask further questions about the certification as well. For example, if I write here, suggest me some forums from where I can get the second certification. Okay, what do we mean by second certification? Well, at the second number, we have Network Plus. If I hit enter, it will further explain the phenomena or you can say it will further explain the process that how we can get this certification from different forums. So I'll just hit enter now and let's see what are the forums it suggests us. It says CompTIA is the first one and here it is explaining then we have its website address then we have Certmaster and obviously it will give us its website address as well. So basically, this is the way that you can follow in order to complete your certification as per your liking. So let's say that we are done with the responsibilities and we also know that what are the certifications we need for this job role. Now let's ask different interview questions that we should prepare for the interview of this job. So I'll write here, I have an interview for this job role or let's define the job role here as well so i'll write here help desk and desktop support job what should i prepare for the interview and let's see what chat gpt suggests us so here it has started with a few things that we should know first of all it says you should know about the job descriptions and what are the requirements of that particular job. Then we should prepare our resume and we should review it. Then we should have a problem solving skills example with us and we should work on our communication skills as well. So this was the basic structure. Now let's ask about specific interview question. So what I'll do this time I'll ask my chat GPT to give me top 20 most asked questions that I should prepare. So I'll write here, please give me top 20 interview questions for the help desk job this time i'm only going for help desk we'll go for the desktop support later 
so i'll hit enter now so now what it will do it will give me 20 potential interview questions that i can prepare so here we have the first one the second one in the third one it says how do you stay up to date on new technologies and trends in the field and there is one more thing that you might have noticed and that is all of these questions are of technical sorts we are not talking about any soft skills yet we'll also ask our chat gpt to tell us about the soft skill so let it get complete with the 20 questions and then we'll move ahead and then we'll ask something else okay as you can see we are done with all the 20 interview questions that we should prepare let's say you have no idea about any one of these let's say there is a question that says what technical support tools or softwares are you familiar with you have no idea and you cannot understand about this particular questions why bother let's ask our chat gpt so i'll write here please explain question number seven and tell me what should i do about it okay chat gpt is smart enough to know that what is the question number seven because chat gpt interacts with us in a conversational way so it remembers everything that we have done till now so if i hit enter now or click on the send button it will generate a question for us as this one and here it is telling us that what should be done and how we can prepare for this particular question so not only it is telling us the questions but it can also tell you about how you can prepare and what are the different contents that you should be looking for this time i'll ask give me only 10 of those questions that are the most repeated one so i'll write here okay give me only 10 of the most repeated questions and let's see what do we get so this time it will make sure to give us only 10 commonly asked questions that are repeated there might be a chances that it might not give you the right answer 100 percent because as it is based on ai it has no information about the physical interview question and answer it is generating all the information on the basis of the training that it has done but still it will give you an idea that what should be your priority in order to prepare for your interview so we are done with the help desk at this time what i'll do i'll ask 20 questions for the desktop support so i'll write here now give me 20 questions for the desktop support interview and let's see what do we get here it is generating the response so what i'll do here i'll write here i have no idea about windows operating system so what should i do and i'll hit enter now it will tell me that you must have windows operating system because it is the requirement for the job and after that it will tell me that what should i do in order to get my hands on this particular operating system so here are some steps that i can take start with the overview then it is telling me to practice using the operating system then it says enroll in a course on training program for that purpose let's ask our chat gpt if there is any such course so i'll write here please suggest me any youtube channel or course that i can follow let's hit enter and let's see what do we get okay it is smart enough and it is telling me about those youtube channels that i can follow in order to learn windows operating system first one says professor adam morgan then we have learned windows 10 then we have eli the computer guy and it says these are the online courses that i can follow so how cool and how smart it is okay we are done with all the problem and let's see what do we can next okay we are done with almost all the technical knowledge and all the technical skills that we might need to prepare for the interview what about the soft skills let's ask our chat gpt to tell us about those as well so i'll write here now please tell me what are the soft skills required for this particular job and remember we are talking about the desktop support person not the help desk so i'll mention help desk and desktop support both here so i'll write here help desk and desktop support and let's hit enter first of all it is defining what are the soft skills and what do we mean by soft skill then it is defining different soft skills first of all we have the communication that we should work on then we have customer service that is required in this particular job then we have problem solving and then we have time management and it will keep telling us 
okay let's say you think that these are not enough you want to have more soft skills that you want to work on you can ask your chat gpt to tell you more about them so let it get complete and then i'll ask my chat gpt to tell me more so i'll write here please tell me five more soft skills to work on so i'll hit enter and let's see what do we get so here it says sure here are five more soft skills that we can have first of all we have empathy then we have patience then we have active listening and then let's see what do we get okay on number four we have conflict resolution and on number five we have communication style okay let's ask our chat gpt to give us the interview questions based on the soft skills so i'll write here give me 15 interview questions based on soft skills for the job i'll hit enter and now it will give me only those questions that are based on soft skills so we can prepare about these as well okay let's say you have no idea or you have difficulty in preparing for one of the questions in here so for this purpose i'll ask my chat gpt to give me the solution or answer for the question number two which says how do you handle difficult customers or users this time i'll write here please tell me the solution for the question number two and let's see what do we get so what it will do it will define the criteria and circumstances for question number two and then it will give me the solution for it as well and here it is defining that what are different strategies that we can follow in order to handle difficult customers or users first one says stay calm listen carefully then we have apology then we have offer a solution and we have some other strategies as well okay at the end let's ask our chat gpt to give us only five soft skills that we can work on in a very short time so i'll write here please tell me about five soft skills that i can work on in very short time and let's see what do we get so basically i want to have those five skills that i can prepare or i can work on in a very short time because let's say i have an interview in one day or two days at the end let's ask one more question and let's conclude this video and for the last questions i'll ask my chat gpt that what are the things i should work on to confirm my job well obviously it will not tell me something that will confirm my job but it will obviously suggest me something that will increase the chances of me securing the job so let's hit enter and let's see what do we get so here it says there are few things that you can work on to increase your chances so as i told you it is not telling me the things that confirm my job because obviously no can confirm this thing so here are different things that i should work on in order to get or in order to secure my job so that was all about this particular video and to conclude this video i would say that you can use chat gpt for anything as per your liking because it's a very powerful tool based on ai and as you have seen in this video that we gave it different circumstances and we asked different questions from it and it gave us the exact answer based on the circumstances and the scenario that we presented to it and i hope now that now you have an idea that how you can use your chat gpt to prepare for the interview for the help desk and desktop support person not only desktop and help desk person you can use chat gpt for any interview and with that i hope now that you must have liked and loved watching this video if that is the case please leave a like subscribe and press the bell icon i'll get back to you in the next video Till then, take care.